Hey, what's up, guys? Vimp here, coming at you with another video. We're going to be playing Pokemon Legends. What a surprise. What a surprise. What a surprise. Still playing 2.4. Um, apparently, the map creator is not going to do any changes before the tournament. So we're going to have to see. We're still practicing a little bit. So you guys might see a little bit more good old Pokemon Legends. So we'll see how that one plays out. We see, okay, okay. We have like, uh, we got pretty lucky. We got the Feebas, which is a very low chance of actually getting it. But somehow we did get it, which is electric and grass, which we need and some type of fighting. So let's go for um, this one. So we can deal with the uh, Feebas nicely. And then we need, we have like two water types, which is the kind of problem at the moment. Some type of fighting to deal with this guy. I mean, I could go for Skarmoni, which he's always like kind of reliable damage, right? Yeah, so you want for a Lulip. Obviously, very powerful and consistent damage in the back. Kind of countered versus Assassin, so you can. Uh, I'm obviously gonna go maybe for a Kabuto. Obviously, counter. The thing is with Fudu, this patch is he's kind of broken. Um, the way he interacts with, I guess, um, is pretty much, uh, the second he dies, he still is alive, which is his ability, after all. He deals more damage whenever it's night, but never, whenever he dies, he, like, still is, like, a kind of a entity, so he still acts as if he's alive, so that's why he's kind of broken, he needs to be fixed, like, ASAP, pretty much. So, yeah, that's how, pretty much, where we stand at the moment. Um... Just gonna see what this guy's doing. We might want to try to counter this guy at the same time. Okay, he has a build them. That's really lucky. Uh, I think it was over here. Yes, Kabuto. Gold is Perfect. Let's upgrade a little bit. We should be able to deal with this guy just fine. It doesn't seem like he's going for any Pokemons. Okay, we seem to be taking this guy out, which is nice. The thing is with this game, you want to make sure that obviously you're fighting this guy, which is the most important one, right? You want to make sure that you're surviving your waves. But at the same time, you want to create pressure on the person to the right. So essentially, you're fighting the person to the left. But your units are being sent to the person to the right. So you want to obviously play for both, right? I mean, that's the ideal case scenario. But you have to do what you... You got to do what you got to do. As the Vimp would say. I've seen a lot of people not sell all of these. Oh, uh, right away. I want to get this one. Jigglypuff. Hmm. I'm just going to wait for the uh, Kabuto, actually. Uh, for now, I guess we just kind of greed. Go for a little, bit, a little bit of an upgrade, but this guy, obviously, one of the best uh, Pokemons in game because he has that Howl. That Howl essentially. Gives him the ability to kind of uh, reduce the amount of damage to all of the um, all of his army, which is a huge deal, right? When it comes to like a lot of Pokemon's <laughs> fighting against each other, right? So kind of don't have a choice to have like these Pokemon's that deal AOE effects. Uh, so even like cripple the enemy or kind of increase the power of your army itself. So. Okay, so we got a Diglett, obviously very good. We, we, I think, what is this guy doing? Hack. <laughs> okay, very interesting behavior. I kind of want to keep this, but remember it deals like it reduces the armor of specific targets. Which is pretty good. Ooh, okay, so we might need to increase our water type. That's too much. The thing is, that's too much fire, it feels like. Go for a little bit of dark, too. Obviously, he's going for the Hoodoom strategy. Yellow's gonna die in no time, I think. Like you see, the Hoodoom is still being active, right? Even though it's dead, it's still active. That's why this um, <laughs> is considered broken and obviously needs to be fixed. But it is what it is. Okay, this guy has really good Pokemons. This one is very strong. Like, this one, God Tier, God Tier, God Tier, God Tier. Big on as well. Let's say that we're sorry. 
Or try to win out here, you know what I mean? Oof. Oh, that's something I definitely want. But the thing is, I might want to use a... This becomes a very good Pokemon, too. Let's go for... Um... I want some Eevees, right? <laughs> Dude, I'm getting roasted. What the hell? <laughs> at least shout outs to Andrew is in the in the video at the moment, which is uh <laughs> he just told me that my videos aren't helpful. <laughs> I mean, to be honest, I'm not a uh a 40 when it comes to this game, right? If you want help, definitely go join the Discord, which I'll probably have it link in the description, but Overall, when it comes to like uh, this game, you definitely want to know which Pokemons are best. Some Pokemons are obviously you want to try to kind of counter to your enemy, but the main thing you want to do is obviously focus on getting Pokemons that are just strong and uh, with it, uh, well themselves, right? So po Pokemons that are strong, for example, just Kabuto, very strong assassin, for example. Uh, this my my Lotic. Just such a stronger and consistent tank. And uh, this one reduces, it does both AoE. This one is obviously just broken. <laughs> it's not supposed to be in the game, but it is. What is this guy doing? Jesus Christ. I do have myself a, like a tier list on the side of my screen, which kind of helps me perform, I guess. If you guys want to try this for yourself. <laughs> People are getting tilted, man. Yeah, he's losing a lot of lives. That's the thing. I feel like he needs to focus a little bit more on countering. Uh, I'm very weak to water. Maybe water would be good against me on this side. Positioning is key. Um, Electric wouldn't be too bad. When he would need ground. He needs a lot of things. <laughs> a lot of things, pretty much. Trap Inch is pretty good. Um, what else do we really want? I guess we'll wait for now. Maybe get a Luck Kid instead of uh, this one. I'm just gonna greet at this point just because I'm countering and, and this guy's not doing much. I'm surprised. Okay, now he's gonna die. So we're gonna have to counter the other guy. Here we go. Finally! Oh, he didn't even beat me. Okay. That's interesting. This is what I mean. Why is it still alive? It has no health. <laughs> he said he's gonna fix it eventually. The uh, 808. That's the map creator. Uh, yeah. So apparently they did enjoy the video I, I did with um, Professor Oak. So how do I do that? Uh, grass, water, electricity, grass. I mean, should I keep this guy? I don't think I should. I mean, it's an extra Pokemon, but... So this one plays out. So now we're playing against Purple, so we're gonna have to somehow counter this guy. Should be able to if we get some good procs on the Elect Kid here. Didn't get too many procs, but at least now we're getting a few, which is nice. Um, I guess Venusaur obviously countered by the Fire types, which we are gonna try to get a little bit more. This one is a very consistent tank, which I might consider going for, but it is another water type because it heals itself, I think. This is very strong, too. Let's go for a bug type here. I want to get this dragon. Right away, it feels bad, man. Is there anything else I really want from this? I don't think there is. I don't have any ground. Nice. Let's get myself a tank here. We'll get the Milotic eventually, too. I guess our main concern for Psychic, we need some type of Ghost, which we do have again. Dark, is it dark? This thing is wrecking everything. You see how this um, Assassin is so powerful? It, it's absurd how strong it is. 
It doesn't even make sense. Like, it went to the backline and killed like three or four units, I think. How bal- that's definitely not balanced. <laughs> Andrew's gonna die soon, I do apologize, he is one of my viewers, so... You just need to learn how to properly counter my... My build, I guess. Level 15 is approaching. What am I really looking for? Wanted to get the uh, eggs in case we get other assassins, but now we have to focus on something else, I think. Electricity, maybe some dark... Let's go for random for now. I'm not too sure what I want to go or what's my strategy. So upgrade this, we get the ability reduction. Damage reduction is 10% at the moment. And yeah, I think it scales up to... Uh, what's it called? 25%. Obviously, super powerful. It Okay, now he gets a proc. So, oh, we're gonna need some ice. I forgot about it. So... What's good against uh, Dragon is Ice and dr Dragon, pretty much, I think. So we definitely are going to go for some Ice. Oof. Speaking of the Devil, that's insane. What is that luck? We don't have any fighting, which is interesting. I don't know if we're gonna get lucky though. I definitely want the. Uh... We'll try this one though. Nice! He's got the oyster. It's gonna be really good against the dragon. I hope he put it in the middle. So, see how, like, now it's a little bit more effective? See how this damage, like, the smallest change in my army made a huge difference because of that uh, dragon, right? So just pretty much try to anticipate and understand which what counter is what. In this case, he is weak to that ice, so that's pretty much why I went for this. Now we want to solidify pretty much our frontline. Maybe get a little bit more backline damage. Because we are limited. It's pretty much frontline only at the moment. Um, I definitely want to go for this one, but the chances of me capturing it is quite low. Fifty percent. Don't like those odds. I'll try it though. No way, I got it. That's insane. I'm getting. I'm getting really lucky. So he put some. Uh, okay, so he did put um, water on the right, which is a good thing to do. At least to counter me. So now I'm gonna have to deal with water somehow on the right here. We'll see what I can do. I'm not focusing too much on green. I'm going to let him survive. He's going to do his best. <laughs> I just want to make sure that I'm surviving against purple and kind of greeting at the same time. Look, okay, Dust Call, that's the one I'm looking for. Okay. So how do I deal against with Blastoise here? Electric and Grass. I'm gonna I'm, I'm start I'm gonna start not greeting as much. Electricity is gonna wreck this. Yeah, you see like the positioning makes a huge difference. All pretty much all my army is alive. Just because I moved this elect kid to the right side and solidified my defenses, I guess, in, the, in this position. I'm not too sure he's working to counter me or is he working to counter his actual opponent. Okay, this is very good. I like this. Ralt's amazing. Absol, obviously powerful. Not something I want yet, though. It's definitely something I'm going to keep. I want Ralt's. Hmm. Maybe I go for Ralt's, right? Nice. Okay, we need something to counter this thing, huh? I have so many lives, to be honest. I I can't afford. I I can actually afford to lose a few 
just go for that extra greed, right? Because the amount of interest that I get extra per round is worth losing a few lives to get extra interest. So to kind of um, make sure that you're pretty much winning the game. Um, at this point we can actually get ourselves the... Our legendary. Not the best legendary, obviously, but it's decent. So it increases the mana regeneration, which is very good. And damage bonus, okay. Let's go for Gardevoir. Uh, look into what I can actually get here. To be honest, I'm just gonna hold my gold. No reason for me. Position my things a little bit better. See how this thing is like not taking any damage. This is one this is one of the best tanks you could get in game. I'm still hunting for something in particular, Dust Call, which does like bun AoE damage, which is pretty cool. Uh, what's what's weak um, to dark? Is it dark itself again? This guy's slowly but surely losing lives. I'm not even trying to be honest. So this guy still has 35 lives. So we're gonna have to consider. I mean, for now we still have a lot to go through. These two guys fighting, round fighting. Okay, water grass. Haven't even, even upgraded this one. Normal damage, which isn't too bad. Could upgrade the Kabuto. This all definitely sell. Scarmoni pretty bad. It's interesting. I don't know why you would place that there. Yeah, the assassin is just so consistent. Um, he has the butterfly, which is very good because it has that kind of drunken haze effect, which I might consider going for, but I'm still hunting that dust call. I think I'm going to stop hunting for it because I'm pretty much wasting time at this point. Still didn't get it. Okay. I do have a second bell done, which is insane. Imagine if I get that. <laughs> um... This guy doesn't have his legendary or what? He's a bit of gold. So good that pushback. The thing is, whenever uh, the Metagrass or the Metang actually push pushes everything back, the damage, all the units stop dealing damage, right? So that's why it's so good. So it kind of enables my my uh, units to deal a little bit more damage. That's why I might consider going for a little bit more backline damage. That's why I wanted the Dust Call, or maybe this one would be good. Let's see. Don't need a second Milotic, that's for sure. Get rid of the Ralts. This one is pretty much useless. Guess I go for this, but I, I don't see... Is there any weakness to Grass? I mean, this just is just so good. I'll show you guys why it's so good. It just does um, it, it does multi shot essentially, and it's good to counter assassins, which I don't know if I've saw for yeah. This guy, someone of so one of these guys has an assassin, so we're gonna definitely need the uh, this one, the tree executor. I think that he's called. We're gonna sell this Scarmoni, pretty much useless at this point. We're gonna try to get a... Um, maybe Diglett wouldn't be too bad, actually. Just to negate a little bit, or just to... Uh, I mean, we could... 6,000 gold, that's absolutely insane. I've never had this much gold, I think. Lily, poof. I mean, that's hard to pass by on, right? Just gonna save for now. 
spend quite a bit of gold, 1.6k, but it's worth it because now I have... Oh, okay, it caps at 20, 20%. So it reduces the enemy's damage by 20% for 6 seconds, which is crazy. 6 seconds obviously matters quite a bit here. Oh, we are fighting red here, okay. So now we should probably stop uh, greeting. It's, it's fine if I lose a lot of lives here. There's a little dragon. Okay, so we're gonna have to see. I haven't been. I didn't prepare for this, I'm not gonna lie. He didn't greed whatsoever. Seems to have a, a lot of dark. So if he has a lot of dark, we're, we're gonna try to counter that. Fighting fairy. Okay. Obviously, this one is fairy, right? Might even get it. Uh, consider going for this one actually. More gold is required. Okay, now we should be in a little bit of a better spot. We'll see. Metang, very bad positioning on the Metang. That's fine though. That's a huge difference. Nice. Place this one in the middle, go this one on the right. Raikou upgraded, that's nice. I should me maybe be looking a little bit more at their comp here. Well, this is very close, actually. Yeah, obviously, Mega Gardevoir completely counters his... Uh... Seems to have survived. Fire on the right. Okay, so I'm just focused here, guys. Uh, definitely want to upgrade the Malalic. I think that's going to be really good. Gardevoir is just doing an absolute, an amazing amount of work at the moment. Just perfect counter to his dark. Uh, obviously, if you want, if you go for that bonus or that legendary, you want to go for a lot of dark. In this case, we're going to go for um, Fairy, which pretty much counters dark. Raikou, my legendary is getting wrecked. But mine completely take, took that and one elf. Awesome. Okay, now we're playing well. Okay, I like this. I like this. Very good play. Very good play. He's somehow still surviving. <laughs> yeah, look at the Mega Gardevoir. Eating him alive. Get out of here, boy. Don't stand a chance against the Vimp. Does he think he is? Lily would be really good consistent damage in the back, so we're gonna sell this one. More gold Have to upgrade this one eventually. Yeah, we're wrecking his left side. He has an, a, a position issue at the moment. That's the thing. If you go for that, you don't have a choice. Oh, he has a legendary, which if he gets, he's... Uh, we're in trouble for sure. 
He still has 25 lives, so it's anyone's game at this point. Uh, is there a Pokemon I want to get rid of? So let's level up or closer because of the, um, what's it called? Dragon, right? Which we want to try to kill as soon as possible. And now we did uh, get ourselves the Milotic upgraded, which is going to be an amazing tank. And I think this one, since it has like a magic shield or anti-magic shield. Or mana shield, that's what it's called. And it, it co combines well with Raikou because obviously he offers mana regeneration. Uh, Metagross, we could go for max Metagross at this point. Uh, we can go for two more Pokemons too, which we are going to go for. Uh... At least I got this one maxed out, so I'm not going to lose any lives. But this one is going to tank for us quite a bit. We're going to have to solidify our right side, it feels like. Yeah, we need to protect our Gardevoir. Okay, he's going to win this one. That's fine, though. Damn. <laughs> Okay, okay, this guy's putting up a fight. Yeah, we're gonna have to uh, defend the, the right side, that's the problem, somehow. He killed my Metagross so easily. Now it's a little bit better. Seems to be defending somehow. So we got these two level up, so we're gonna have an amazing assassin here, hopefully dealing with all these. Yeah, look at the assassin, it's just doing so much work. The only problem is these two, right? Should have probably man, this is a very powerful tank. Okay. So this is an issue. <laughs> One head from it, damn. Um, I, f I would assume he has to upgrade uh, that Drakai or whatever it's called. He's getting so many legendaries. Should have probably upgraded my Raikou like yesterday, right? I need to get uh, this tank. <laughs> oh, he got the Mega. <laughs> oh, it's getting stuck, though. That's a huge bummer. At least we wrecked his arm in here. Man, this is a good fight. This is a good battle. Holy. Battle of the Titans. Well, let's go for it. I love the level that one up. It seems like it's super, uh, it's definitely worth it, I feel like. And Drakai is wrecking everything I own. At least I'm defending. How, how is it that powerful? That's crazy. 
We need some, like, um, damage reduction. Or some type of sheep, or... Healing... I'm trying to think here. I don't know if it's worth going for... Damage bonus. More gold is required. I guess some type of tank against this thing. It doesn't like level 100. It like wrecks everything. <laughs> this thing like I have so many Pokemon's hitting it, and it apparently doesn't die. So I'm definitely need that tank. It seems like it's a god tier unit for sure. I hope I'm not gonna lose this, right? These two are always the ones freaking left. Okay, so how do I counter these two? They don't want to have like Gardevoir, which should help. Fighting Fairy Ground. Fighting Fairy. Need this thing uh, upgraded ASAP. Mega. This mega form is gonna help like quite a bit. Damn. This thing refuses to die. How is it that powerful? Level 100. Maybe I should level 100 my Raikou too. <gasps> Swap blue. We need, we need it. We need it. I think that's gonna be the game changer here. Oh my god, I just sold an Eevee. I fuck, effed up. I'm gonna lose a lot of lives here, I feel like. I kept so much gold for some reason. Never mind. It's crazy that I'm winning here, but he's surviving here somehow. Okay, so now look at the difference, okay? I'm gonna get the Mega. We're also gonna get, get Swablu. And this guy level 100 reduces the damage, has damage reduction by 16% and attack speed bonus by 40%. There's no way this guy survives here. Finally, now it's surviving against this freaking ultimate thing. See, if we reduce the amount of damage output this thing can deal, then we're, we're pretty much golden. Yeah, we're like our army is like fully <laughs> fully maxed out still. Let's get this uh Raikou maxed out. Might as well. And I think we're gonna greed the rest. Ah, uh, let's get this guy. Can get a mega? I didn't know this. There's so many megas, holy. <gasps> I've never been this far. So this is the final battle or something? Wait. Wait, I'm not ready for this. Team? This is hilarious. I love how we have time to prep and stuff. Can't really upgrade anything else now. This this is for all the marbles, guys. <laughs> there we go. For all the marbles. This is what we've been waiting for. The final showdown. Who's gonna take it home? Who's gonna take it home? Is it gonna be the VIP? Or the mighty 
done. It feels like we're winning this, guys. It feels like we're winning this. GG. Well played. What a freaking game. What a game. That was amazing. What a freaking amazing showcase. I'm so happy about this game. Man, it's so rare that you get these, <laughs> these good games. But it feels like we definitely performed very well. I feel like Professor Oak is going to pat me in the back or something. <laughs> oh, man. That... that I'm just happy. I'm just happy. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this. If you guys want to see more of this in the future, make sure to like the video and subscribe for more. It takes two seconds of your time, guys. Guys, just click on that subscribe button. Help your boy Vimp out. Uh, most of you guys aren't even subscribed that are watching my, my videos, so feel free to do so. It does uh, help out the channel. And uh, if you guys want to go that extra mile and become members, that would be amazing. So you guys can have the ability to kind of request maps and so on. So thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day or evening. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, guys. You shall be king.